It is a tough reality so many families now face. That includes the family of Alex Delgado, who was shot and killed nearly six months ago. His killer is still out there. News Channel 5's Araceli Crescencio spoke with the grieving family during a march today held in his honor. For Obdulia Delgado Alvarado, the bond between a mother and son is unbreakable. My son was a very good kid. He was a very good kid, and it shows. A bond that even after his death six months ago remains intact. Metro Police say on January 7th, 16-year-old Alexander Lara was driving when somebody shot him in the head, leading him to crash into the IHOP off Nolensville Pike and Harding Place. He was taken to Vanderbilt Medical Center but died. Police have released the picture of a man they believe to be linked to the vehicle that fired the shots that killed Alex. Lara's family tells News Channel 5 they believe the incident started after a car backed into Alex's at a gas station and drove away. Alex tried to follow the car and the violence escalated. His family and friends say they're disheartened and frustrated that his killer has not been caught. We are suffering and it's not fair that we have to sit and wait and just cry every single day wishing something can get done going to the cemetery to visit the person that we know that was so young that could have we could have seen grown up, we could have seen gone to college, we could have seen graduate, we could have seen got married, you know? A spokesperson for Metro Police says the case has been staffed by the district's attorney's office and they're awaiting decisions. But for Alex's friends and family, every single day that passes by opens the door for another tragedy. Because it's been six months, six months that we still don't have an answer that gives us any relief. In Nashville, Araceli Crescencio, News Channel 5.